All right, folks, welcome back. Today we are going thrifting, always looking for golf clubs or anything else cool that we could use ourselves, sell online, or just have fun trying out and then donate back at the end. But never know what you're going to find, so let's go find it. Let's go find it. Also, we're getting super close to 150,000 yes, subscribers. You so thank you guys for that. We're going to have a big special and giveaway, but let's get things started off here. Perfect place to start. We got two thrift stores in the same parking Double lot Goodwill whammy. and a teen challenge super thrift easy to say i always forget the name of that yes. one but uh, let's see what we can find today well lots of golf clubs in here today well this one's got like a weird insert pro connects eternity high modulus graphite insert that's kind of uh cool uh -huh. what else do we got over here a prima got looks like we more got more pro connects more pro connects yep. over there oh it's like a full set of those mm -hmm. looks like it's a full set of these the uh, texans I know I've seen the uh, wedges for sale on Amazon. They're like 79 bucks for a full set of wedges. Never tried the uh, irons. Well, actually, never tried the uh, wedges to uh, no. for that. Instrument. Instrument. Wow. Very interesting Expanded things. impacts. Oh, we got uh, Adam's Ovation. These things are super easy to uh, hit. Mm -hmm. Got an Aldi Law NV shaft, or just an like Aldi Law stock shaft in there. Came with the uh, Adam's, although it is green, so it might be an Aldi Law NV yeah. shaft in there. Got a bunch of tennis rackets down there. Oh, Looks got a like Callaway bag. Oh, uh, Callaway it's bag. It's not in the greatest condition, though. Oh, man. Oh, that's a pretty sweet bag, though. Mm -hmm. Oh, there it goes. A little Top Flight Junior bag. Yeah, it's cute. Yep. Also, this music is amazing. Almost as amazing as this side. That is <laughs> kind of terrifying. It's kind of terrifying. You want it? Uh, no, we'll let another Ashley have we'll it. We'll let though. another Ashley. There's enough for you. <laughs> We're definitely going to get the uh, Adam's Ovation. Yes. The uh, sign wasn't worthy of Ashley's Ovation. Nope. Or is that No, Ovation is like when crowds go wild. I'm not, I'm not giving it a standing ovation. There you go. go. <laughs> you, you helped me. You picked me up there. Yes. Oh man, that painting definitely did not deserve a standing ovation, but check out these two finds. Maybe those were the droids we were looking for. It's imagine deep. imagine <laughs> bringing that in uh, Galaxy's Edge and right. uh, try to talk to the uh, stormtroopers. Uh -huh. Also, check this out. Ooh, old school cool. Old school cool. Titleist by Corbin. Sweater vest. If this was red, a little Bobby Knight action. Oh yeah, for sure. Still might get this. That's amazing. <laughs> All right, found a club at the first thrift store. Let's see if the second one is just as good. Oh man, I think they're expanding. This place is already pretty big. Yeah. For having two thrift stores in the same parking lot, it's gonna get even bigger. Oh, we got a stove in here. Let's see if there's anything worth picking up. In terms of the golf clubs, I don't think we're coming home with a stove. <laughs> oh, we got some uh, McGregor Woods over here. I think these are Persimmon Statesman by Nicholas. Those things are stunning. Not in the best shape or else we would pick those up. Might be fun to uh, restore those one day. We need to get into uh, that. Mm -hmm. What is this one? The Imprex? Impex. Impex. Got some weird names going yes. on. Oh, <laughs> speaking of weird, we got a Samurai 7 iron. These oh, things nice. are awesome. Didn't we find those at like a flea market and the guy wanted like $700 for the yeah, first set? Yeah, this was the first time I've ever seen them. Yeah. And I was like, why does this guy want $700 for them? I looked him up. They were going for basically $700. Yeah. At least like two years ago, they were. At least now we actually get to try one. Yeah, that guy like had a, uh, it was like an estate sale. He like bought out an estate sale and this guy has some of the craziest golf clubs I've ever yeah. seen. And we had, find like, some really weird golf yeah, clubs. Yeah, <laughs> that's saying something if we yes. think it's crazy. <laughs> Graphite head, these things are crazy. Uh -huh. Definitely have to uh, try that out. Oh, it's not yeah. a full set of them. But I like that price point Yeah, better. I like this uh, price point. Well, there's no price on it. Hopefully it's <laughs> well, not $700. Not. <laughs> Updates to come. Doesn't look like there's anything else in here nah. for us, but I think this one is uh, more yeah, than that's enough cool, for us. Sweet, the golf club is only $2 and also $2. Check this out, it's a Zabar's. I think like a gift basket came yeah. in it, but I used to go to that place all the time when I was a kid. It's like a famous grocery store in uh, New York City. Mm -hmm. Heard it's really good bagels too. Yeah, well, it had pretty good bagels, but right now, I think it was kind of close to H&H uh, &H bagels, which had the best bagels ever. Your family talks about that all yeah, the time. Yeah, <laughs> cream cheese, doesn't need anything. Perfect things, as is. Yeah, perfect as is. We used to get like a dozen of them, and by the time we got home, there was less than a dozen. <laughs> less than a dozen. <laughs> Well, we'll uh, meet you at the uh, next spot. No golf clubs. Oh, there's one up there. What is that? Putting Frankly Frog Putter. What is the Putting Cyclops? Too? Putting Cyclops with Michael Breed up there too. Mm. Updates to come. Well, quick update. We looked up on uh, eBay and they are going all over the place, but one of them went for $175. Yeah, proof. There we go. It looks pretty cool, though. This one's only going for $20. I like that price better. Yeah. This thing looks pretty interesting, too. Mm -hmm. It looks like the new, uh, what's the one that uh, Charles Schwartzel uses? I forget what it's called. Those are like 600 bucks. Yeah, I know what you're talking about, but for their pub, too. Yeah, we'll give it a try. Fun to negotiate one, Sweet. one way or another. Do you know the best you can do on this? It's been in here for a while. Um, 
I need 15 on the door. Can you do 15 out the door? No. Uh, that's fine. It's like 30 or 40 cents. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's always fun to stay out the door. <laughs> well, frankly, I never thought I'd be a buyer of a Frankly Frog putter. That sounded funnier in my head, but uh, this thing is actually pretty cool. And some of them are going for big bucks on uh, eBay, so it'll be fun to uh, try out. Mm, what do I we also get? like that you like, tried to haggle over a dollar. Yeah. Well, it's 100 pennies. Yeah, there you go. There you it's go. worth you, it. You always Every try penny get it counts. out the door. Also, yep. speaking just outside the door of this pawn shop, there's another one. Let's go see if there's anything over there for us. Nice segue. There you go. That's my, that's my job, segues. <laughs> All right, right by the uh, wetsuits. There was nothing at that one pawn shop across the street, but a Titleist bag that was a little overpriced. It was kind of cool, though, but... Got some cannon irons over here. Oh, we got more around the corner, too. Future Force. What do you get? More around the corner. Oh, nice. You can go scouting at the wireless mics. <laughs> oh, we got a, uh, I think that's a Nike Sumo, a Cobra Offset, three wood. We got a uh, Odyssey Two Ball. Odyssey Two Ball's got a bunch of dirt on it, but it's actually not in that bad a condition. Let's see what we can do on it. It's been in here for like seven, almost eight months now, so we'll see yeah, what we can do on it. That's the first time I noticed it up there. Yeah, I didn't know they had golf clubs no. up there. How's, How's it going? It going you guys? Good. You know the best union that's been in here quite a while? What's your offer on it? Can you do 20? I do 30. All right, another putter, an Odyssey 2-Ball F7. Some of these things are going for like over $100, but most of them are going for around $60 or $70, so not a bad deal for huh. $30. Bucks. Plus, I haven't tried that one before. Yeah, World's Greatest Putter will uh, get to uh, try that out. Mm -hmm. Also, I've never seen anybody. We comment on it a lot. I've never seen anybody at this uh, Burger King. <laughs> no. <laughs> we always make fun of uh, Burger Kings and Sears, but I kind of like both of them. Yeah, when Burger King is good, it's really good. Yeah. When it's bad, it, it's, it's pretty bad. <laughs> it's pretty bad. I have to agree on that. But uh, hopefully our next stop will be better than Burger King, and we'll find some... Something other than a putter. Or a burger. That or a burger, yeah. A burger at a uh, pawn shop <laughs> or a thrift store. Not so good. That's a hard pass. Yeah. Oh. oh, there's golf clubs over here. Usually they buy the fishing poles. That is true. Oh, wait, Cali Rogue, Two Ridge. What kind of putter, Two Ridge putter? See if that's Cali Rogue under there. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Got a big old dent on there too. That's all you need to do is upgrade. No one needs to know. False advertising. We'll meet you at the next spot. Almost got the uh, find of the day. <laughs> Almost got us. You know this pawn shop is going to be good. Look at him go. Look at him. Oh. How's it going? He says he might have golf clubs in the VIP room. There is some uh, over here. I don't even know what these are. They're confidence. They give confidence. you confidence. I don't even know a brand that is or model. Nope. It's the Confidence HG7. That's all you need to know. Yeah. We'll see what the VIP clubs are like though. Yes. These are brand new. Okay. They just came out like last week. I think they go for like 1700 brand new. But those are brand new too. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Do you know the best you'd be able to do on these? Uh, we haven't even hit the floor yet. Man. Gotcha. You're the first person to yeah. see them, man. So. Do you know if you got any wiggle room on them? I mean, I'm not too sure. Maybe after like the eight days, they're supposed to be on the floor if they last that long. Okay. Oh, yeah. Usually, they're you know, after like, a little bit, yeah. Yeah. It's usually a lot more than we spend on. Yeah. Gio would be like 750. Like I said, man, um, they haven't even come out. Let me ask my boss. All right. They haven't hit the floor. How can I know. you make an offer like that? That's what I'm saying. They haven't even hit the floor. They haven't. We haven't put them out for sale. She wouldn't yet. let me go home if I didn't make an offer. Yeah, that's, that's out of my comfort zone. <laughs> All right, folks, $750 for some brand new in plastic tailor made P790 irons. I think it's going to be hard to beat. I think it's going to be impossible to beat because these are some of the most expensive golf clubs that you can buy right now. We found a brand new in plastic at a pawn shop, so I think it goes uh, safe to say this is going to be the most expensive uh, golf club find in the history of the uh, channel. Yes. Well, until next year when they raise the price on clubs, but then we would also have to find them brand new in a pawn shop. So, not very likely. Yeah, yeah. so. 
with an asterisk, this is going to be the most expensive uh, golf club find ever on the uh, channel. It's going to be hard to beat. It's yes. basically what I'm getting at, but we're very excited about them. Just got done trying everything out the driving range. We'll throw up some shot tracers and some eBay comps. I say everything, but you'll see why we didn't try everything when we show the uh, comps. Mm -hmm. But uh, hopefully you'll forgive us for that. Yes. But uh, we're out at the driving range today because our local golf course completely flooded. Yeah. We have some crazy weather here lately. But we did replace it with the nation's largest driving range. Yeah, it's like a mile circle. Yeah, this is where they have the uh, PGA Merchandise Show. And now I'm spinning around in a circle. Sorry about that. But <laughs> where they have the PGA Merchandise uh, show it's like a mile circle long driving, driving range. range so hopefully that suffices no we golf tried. course but the uh, nation's <laughs> largest uh, driving range but let's go through everything that we got in the order that we got it first up we got the adams ovation offset three wood actually it's got more names adams ovation tight lies adams 630 always does that. yeah it's like a lexus it has like a bunch of uh, letter and number combinations i have no idea yeah. what any of them uh, mean but uh you end up getting a good product with the lexus you end mm -hmm. up getting a good product with the adams while they and I were... hit it really well because it offsets it helps with my slice yeah so. it helps uh, with ashley's slice so we're still trying to uh, fix but the yep. uh, golf club helps it out a little bit yeah. kind of hides your airs and accentuates it a little bit but little we're gonna, we've spent some time on the range hopefully mm -hmm. going to uh, fix out the uh, slice get ashley out there breaking her course record carrying the uh, bunker oh we got to do that uh, sometime soon yes, very soon. it's probably our most requested video <laughs> besides a uh, what's in the bag we'll do both of those on the same day one time Ooh, that's a lot of pressure that's a lot of pressure you gotta carry a bunker and talk about your clubs uh, we'll, we'll see how that goes we'll see how that goes but super easy to uh, hit i actually went from hitting a fade to a draw recently I picked up like 10 or 15 yards mm -hmm. so i'm super excited about that but this thing basically turned my uh, draw into a hook so we're not going to be uh, fighting about that no. one. We might be fighting about if we found a, a full set of yes. these, these Samurai 7 irons. These things are unbelievably weird looking and uh, super light. Well, that car is very loud, sorry yep. about that. But uh, super light, and it doesn't look like it would be because this head is gigantic, mm -hmm. but it's uh, made out of graphite. That's really like a hollow body, basically the uh, older iteration of what a hollow body oh, tailgate yeah. p790 is but this thing was super long and super forgiving it looks yeah, super goofy but it was crazy yeah i hit that like a mile mm -hmm. i can see why they go for uh, 700 dollars. they're also notorious for uh, cracking because the head is uh, super fragile so that's why there's not very many of them still in good condition so that's why they go for a ton I'm of money i finally got to try it out though yeah super excited to have uh, tried that i think i've said super and excited many we're, times we're super excited yeah we're super excited <laughs> about that but uh, also well i wasn't very super excited about the uh, putters when we tried them out <laughs> I did really like the uh, Frankly Frog one. It feels like a super high-end premium milled putter. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, basically what normally happens on the putting green happened. We'll play that whole clip at the end so you guys believe us. But yeah. I lipped out too. Ashley just smacked him right in the middle of the uh, hole. Yep. Like a 15-footer. You just step up and hit him. Two putts. No That's big all deal. she needs. It's just, <laughs> sorry about yeah. that. Well, you, you shouldn't be sorry. You are the world's greatest putter. Well, I play too much break and then you just smack yeah. him in the yep. back of the hole. They literally almost popped out. That's mm -hmm. how hard you hit Yeah, him. if I miss it, it's going way by. Yeah, you're like a three-putt machine Yeah. because you basically have a 15 footer your first putt and your second putt if you don't make it but you make more putts than i do so i can't really hey, I mean, it works yeah i should putt more boldly yes there you go there you go but uh the uh odyssey uh two ball f7 one of the worst saudi putters that i've ever hit to be yeah. honest with you it sounds like an aluminum bat mm -hmm. or a uh scotty camera now future oh. and i made the putt with it but i really don't like how it looks over the ball yeah it's, it's uh, kind of funky there's too much uh, going on for uh -huh. me i need something uh, simple although i don't make any putts so what do i know but the uh, <laughs> frankly frog like i was uh, saying super high end uh, oh, feeling yeah. and i can see why well some of them are going for over a hundred dollars Mm -hmm. and the uh, odyssey one's going for like 60 or 70 in that condition so not a terrible deal no. but definitely the deal of the day yeah. the tailor-made p790s brand new in plastic four iron all the way down to the pitching wedge with the mmt shafts in there this is one of the most uh, expensive combos that you can get i think they have a ventus shaft option which goes for like 1700 but as you can see right there the pawn shop was trying to get a thousand dollars out of them it was kind of uh, funny yeah. we like went in there and i'll set up the whole story because we didn't really film it the whole thing because we went in there and all mm -hmm. we saw were those old golf clubs so i turned off the camera and then the, as we were walking out the guy was like uh, can I help you? And I was like, yeah, you have any uh, golf clubs you haven't yeah, put Michael out? Asked. And his eyes lit up. He was like, yeah, I got some in the back. We haven't even put out yet. What do you call it? The VIP room? Yeah, the VIP room. <laughs> Made me feel really uh, special. He brought them out. I was like, oh, it's going to be some just like crusty old stuff or yeah. whatever. Like he's trying to sell us. No, they were brand new tailor-made P790 irons. And I couldn't believe you asked that price. Yeah. That was bold. He was like, I'm not going to negotiate with you. No. I was like, ah, can you do 750? And then he just looked at me like, no. Right. And then I was like, eh. then he went over to the uh, boss and the lady. She was hilarious. Yeah. We'll uh, have to cut out some of the stuff that she said it was a little... It was funny, but it was funny, but yeah, I was not expecting them to actually agree to that. Price. Yeah, seven hundred and fifty dollars is a crazy <laughs> yes. deal. These things, brand new, go for about. I think this still has one of the uh, prices on it. It was like fourteen ninety nine. Yeah, I think on so. On eBay, brand new, they go for about fourteen hundred or thirteen fifty, and used, they go for about a thousand. So hopefully, you guys aren't too bad at us for uh, not taking the uh, plastic off and cost ourselves about four hundred dollars. Yeah. But one day we'll uh, go into uh, Golf Galaxy and uh, hit them. 
There we go. We should do it on Instagram. That's yeah. why. Follow Compromise. Us on, follow us on Instagram for food pictures. We never post anything about golf. There you go. We'll have a rare golf. Yeah, a rare <laughs> golf one. Us hitting the uh, P790s. Uh, probably followed by food. Yeah, probably followed by food. So uh, make sure you follow us for the worst Instagram account to go along with the worst YouTube channel of all time. It's fitting. Yeah, it's fitting. But uh, hope you guys did like this video. Again, stay tuned for Ashley just taking... conquering that bunker. Oh yeah, conquering the bunker and then literally like taking my soul out while you just make oh, cuts yes. left and right. Well, that's nothing new. I'm used to that. <laughs> I, I don't have a soul if you've taken it so many times, but uh, hopefully you guys did like this video. Again, super close to 150,000 subscribers. We <laughs> found the uh, TaylorMade Stealths brand new in plastic. Mm -hmm. These brand new in plastic. We are going to be giving away one of the uh, TaylorMade Stealths Intent. for 150,000 subscriber special. Yeah. Uh, so stay tuned for that. Whew, what a day. That we started impressive. off kind of slow. I was like, I'm a, I get excited about the Adams Ovation yes. and the weird stuff, but P790s, definitely. Quite These are literally ending. this year's model. Well, 2021, 2022, they haven't come yeah. out with a new one yet, but whew, what a day. Hard to beat. Hard to beat. Hope you guys did like this video. Hit the like button for Ashley beating me on the uh, putting green and uh, just in life. Yep. Yeah. Nothing new here. <laughs> we'll see you next time. Bye, guys. It's not fair. It's not fair. That is just not fair. Also, the food at this place is killer. Ashley got a Cajun BLT, which is a fried green tomato, and it's got like a remoulade sauce on there. Sweet potato fries, not an extra. Also, I got a Caesar salad, not an extra for a burger. I'm very... Extra pickles. Ashley, extra pickles. <laughs> we'll see you next time. That's your uh, treat of the day for beating me up, honey. Yep. <laughs>